Hi, I'm Terry Kilo Oscar for Whiskey Foxtrot Papa, and this is Abby Glenn W4YES. And we're here today to talk about ICR versus the comprehensive ICR course that CW Innovations offers. We want to clear up a misconception. Yeah, it's 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 where ICR is in the total landscape of of learning how to do this is uh, there is a misunderstanding that the goal is ICR. Everything you do is to recognize those characters quickly, and once you do, you are good to go. And and that's not true, because if you want to become conversational with CW, you want to be able right. to head copy and follow a train of thought, you have to have more than ICR. There's a, there's a, there's a set of skills mm -hmm. beyond ICR. ICR is pouring the concrete for the concrete, for the, for the slab, for the foundation. Mm -hmm. If you're building a house, so to speak, the foundation is necessary, but that's not the house. So ICR is just the beginning. It's the start. It's like if you're going to go on a trip and you went out to your car and put the keys in or whatever and you push the button to start and the engine starts up, that's ICR. You haven't traveled one inch, but you have to have that car running in order to travel. So mm -hmm. that's what ICR is. And we want to be clear that what we have put out at CW Innovations on our YouTube channel in that first four video series of ICR is not what we teach in the comprehensive ICR course. Okay, ICR, as Glenn said, is the foundation. And then there's a whole nother set of skills in our course that we, that we teach. And that is not something that we plan to release here on YouTube. Why is that? Because th th there's, there's more to this than just head knowledge. Right. There's an experiential yes. component of that. To experience it. And to experience it and to walk successfully through the methodology, you need a trainer, somebody who can help show you um, how to go through the material and help you when you run into roadblocks or obstacles as you're learning the material, you're learning to train with it. And you also need to put that training into practice. That's Code Buddy QSOs um, and other work on the air. And having a team, being in a class environment where you have other people that are supporting you along that journey is important. And it sets you up for success with what you're trying to accomplish. There's so that's why we don't just release that in general. And there's an entire structure to it. There's mm -hmm. a beginning and there's an end. Mm -hmm. Because the skills build on top of one yes, another in a logical progression. It's scaffolded. It's a scaffolding process where you're building one thing upon the other. And, and there's a lot of people that we receive feedback at the end of the course because we ask everybody, all our team members, what did we do well and what do we need improvement on? One of the things that we hear consistently is, wow, this made sense. Yes. There's structure. Finally, somebody is telling me how to actually do this because I can't find that anywhere else. Yeah, I heard someone say that I've always been told what to do when it comes to this. But not but, how to do it. But how to do it. Right. And the how needs to have a structure. It needs to have a beginning, has an end, and everything in between. It needs to scaffold one upon the other. That's right. So just to be clear, what we've released, the ICR videos, is not what's in our course. It's necessary. It's necessary. It's what I like to call it's the, the hub foundation. of the wheel. Mm -hmm. It's the hub of the wheel. Everything comes from that. So that's mm -hmm. the most important piece of this, but it's just a start mm -hmm. to all the fun. Another thing about ICR, since we're talking about ICR right here, is that it is a process. And we address that in the introductory video. We have people that take our course that begin working with ICR and they get to the next skill, which is missing fast, and they go, oh, I've got ICR. And all of a sudden they go, well, exactly, I don't have ICR. And then we move to words and we progress through words and then we move to phrases. And at every single point along this, this journey in the class, people go, well, I didn't have ICR quite as much as I thought yeah. I did because you're introducing new skills. And as you introduce new skills, you're stressing yourself. You're finding more places where you need work on ICR. So it's a process. It's you're not a one and done. And the stress is what I like, turning up the heat on the pot. So you have, mm -hmm. you have something boil. You finally bring it to a boil by putting that heat under it, by stressing it, by, by testing yourself. Mm -hmm. And what happens is those troublesome characters begin to bubble to the top. 
Mm-hmm. You can't discover what those are and work on them until they've been they've been discovered. And that's that reveals that is when they're but once like you say, once you get to words and phrases, this puts more stress on your ability to do these other skills mm-hmm. on top of IC. Now you're doing these things concurrently and it's a lot lot going on. Um so th- that that's that's the thinking behind it. it it's, it's amazing. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It is. So anyway, that's it. We've answered that, that answered that question. Yeah. If you have more questions for us, you let know us to, know. You know where to find us. Info at cwinnovations.net. Thank you. Yeah. Take care.